neglected park on Greensboro's east side that is sitting on top of a hazardous waste facility is finally getting the attention it needs. An $11 million grant could restore Bingham Park, making sure families can once again enjoy it. Fox 8's Natasha Lager spoke with community members about these funds. So, Natasha, how do they want that money used? Well, they want the waste that's underneath this ground to be completely removed and the park restored. It used to be a place where kids will have fun and family will enjoy, but it's now completely abandoned and it's literally just falling apart. We're working on trash. This is garbage. Welcome to Bingham Park in Greensboro. The park used to be a landfill with an incinerator to burn garbage. In 2015, environmental testing revealed major ground contamination and it had to close. It's very scary because I live 500 feet away. And so it's very concerning that you want a place, a clean space for children to come to play and to run. Cheryl Johnson doesn't take her kids to this park because of over the years, the park shows signs of sinking, cracking and contamination. There are large boulders on both sides, which when you see large boulders, that means do not enter. So we never ventured out to the park for something for them to do. The city of Greensboro received $11 million to conduct remediation to the park and other downtown Greensboro areas. But there's no plans yet on how that money is going to be used. I think that's awesome. We know that all of that can't be spent here right now. This is going to take a while. This is not tomorrow. And the next step for the city is to have meetings with community members here and discuss how they're going to use that $11 million and what's going to be the actual plan for the remediation here in this park. Live in Greensboro, Natasha Lager, Fox 8 News.